Hello everyone, starting machine here, and this is Monster SP2023. Ducati's World Premier Series yielded a second new model for 2023 after the Street Fighter V4 Lamborghini, the Monster SP. After restarting the Monster Series in 2021 by fitting a liquid-cooled V-twin into an aluminum twin spar frame, Ducati has upped the ante with a new version that sports higher spec gear. There are also some hints of yellow and gold, revealing a pivotal new part of the Monster SP, its suspensions. Signed by Swedish specialists Olens, these include inverted 43mm NIX 30 forks and a monoshock rear unit, both fully adjustable, of course, as well as a steering damper. Ducati's upgrades extend down to the braking system, where the M432 radial calipers of the basic Monster give way to Brembo's latest crown jewel, Stylema. According to Ducati, the Monster SP's wet weight is 2 kg less than that of the standard model, tipping the scales at 186 kg in running order. These benefits result from lighter parts, such as the brake calipers and the exhaust, as well as a new lithium battery. The 2023 Monster SP is designed and equipped for sportier riding, both on the street and the racetrack, so shaving almost 1 kg from the front wheel will certainly cater for sharper and lighter steering. Few things change in the electronics department, as Ducati had done a very good job with the 2021 Monsters package in the first place. The kit includes traction control, launch control, wheelie control, cornering abs and three riding modes, and offers ample adjustability. Nevertheless, Ducati decided to introduce a new riding mode, wet, in place of the urban mode of the Monster, which limits power output to 75 horsepower with very soft throttle response. The other two modes, Sport and Road, release the engine's full horsepower with differences in abs, traction and wheelie control settings, as well as throttle sensitivity. Ducati has not revealed any information regarding pricing and delivery times, but whenever it hits the market it will also be available in a restricted 35kW version that's compatible with the European A2 driving license 8.